It was a moment that caused English hearts to sink. With just 16 minutes left in England's final Euro 2012 qualifier against Montenegro and qualification secured for the tournament as things stood, Wayne Rooney was sent off for kicking out at Miodrag Zudovic. A three-match suspension that was later reduced to two, making him unavailable for England's opening Euro 2012 games against France and Sweden. But as Rooney eyes a return to action against Ukraine in England's final Group D fixture on Tuesday, has the Manchester United striker managed to curb his temper? I think I have done all season. I think, um, you know, the, what happened was a mistake. Uh, I understood that. I apologised to the guy and, you know, um, that's gone. Obviously, I've paid the price. Um, I've, I've had to take it and, you know, um, I've, I've no problems with um, my attitude. I've no problems with um, my temperament and, you know, I'm, I'm happy and I'm ready to play. Should Rooney start against the co-hosts, he couldn't have asked for a tougher test of temperament. Carrying the hopes of a nation, around 45,000 locals will be packed into the Donbass arena to make life difficult for Roy Hodgson's men. I think um, we've been to a lot of stadiums around, around Europe, around the world, and you know, we've had to deal with, um, with this atmosphere um, a lot of occasions. You know, I think if you look at Turkey Way, you know, Nine, ten years ago, it was um, that's as hostile as you're going to get. So um, we understand it's going to be a, a big atmosphere, and you know that's something we have to deal with. And you know, I think we're all, you know, big enough and experienced, play, experienced enough to deal with that. As Ukraine fans spur on their country to the victory required to reach the quarterfinals, Tuesday's clash in Donetsk is sure to be an assault on the senses. But if he can keep his cool in the hostile atmosphere. Rooney can do his bit to help England reach the last eight. England need just a point to secure qualification from Group D.